Ellipsoidal reflector spotlights, or LICOs, are the most flexible of the standard instruments in the theatrical line designer's inventory. When using the shutters on a LICO, be aware that they function opposite to their placement. When the physical bottom shutter is pushed in, the top of the light is brought in. Using a LICO gives you the option of using a gobo, also known as a template or pattern. The gobo is inserted near the conjugate focal point and is slot by the top shutter. This template will allow a pattern of light to be projected. Many different patterns, or gobos, are available, and they can be specially designed and ordered if necessary. In addition to a slot for patterns, some modern instruments offer the option of inserting an iris unit. Similar to a camera's aperture, this allows you to make a throw smaller in a circular shape as opposed to straight shutters. This extra slot may also accept other special effects, such as this effects loop tray. For this example, I have a ring pattern that continually rotates in a never-ending loop. Other options available include realistic clouds, water, and fire. Be sure the effect loop is running before turning on the light because of the lamp's heat. The effect wheel typically requires an additional circuit or power, and some can use DMX signal or voltage changes to affect speed. Other types of effects, such as gobo rotators, are also available. This extra large slot also allows for the use of a glass gobo, in this case created by small pieces of acrylic glass to create a stained glass effect. Add an optional gobo to really complete the effect with just one light source. The lenses on a LICO are adjustable. This process of adjusting the lenses is called running the barrel. Running the barrel allows the light produced to have a sharp or soft edge. If using a gobo, this will enable you to make the pattern crisp and clear or fuzzy and diluted. To produce an extremely sharp edge to the image or light, a donut may be inserted into the gel frame area. A donut needs to be made of a heat-resistant material, not a flammable substance like wood. The donut will eliminate the unfocused light, called hylation, and further clarify the pattern. Realize that using a donut will cause some of the light's intensity to be lost. On the occasion where the front of the unit is being exposed to the audience, you may wish to use a top hat. A top hat has a negligible effect on the thrown light of the unit, but it will serve to hide the lenses and the source of the light from the audience. In addition, it also reduces unwanted glare. Some modern units will also allow you to rotate the housing of the unit, which permits more specific shutter cuts and gives the designer more control over the projection of patterns thrown by the unit. A selection of modern ellipsoidal reflector spotlights allows you to adjust the lenses in the unit, which affects the throw or size of the light coming from the fixture. In this case, using an ATC Source 4, I can quickly change the lens casing, making a wider throw of 36 degrees up from 19. 